On this Fit Friday, we're here with Noah Aldridge, Big Time Results, and we're talking about squats today. And this isn't a, a workout where you're trying to put as much weight on as you can. No. This is something different. Yeah, squats is kind of one of those foundational pillars to exercise, um, especially when it comes to resistance training and just incorporates so many different aspects of the body. Um, the important parts of um, squats as you age is that it, you know, it works your lower body but it engages your core. Um, so many people have lower back issues and they don't realize like your abs are kind of like your human made weight belt. So if you don't have a strong core and you go to squat, you're gonna put yourself at risk for injury because your torso is just gonna fly forward. So it's really important that you do some developmental things and make sure you have a strong core before um, you know, putting actual weight on your back. So just doing body weight squats. Um, you're, you've kind of progressed to the point where we can put some weight on the bar and do those squats. The thing for someone like you is that as you age, your testosterone tends to go down and uh, squats is one of those exercises that's been proven to release HGH, hum human growth hormone, um, as long, along with deadlift. So it's really good to have healthy testosterone levels for a male um, to do squats. And it activates a lot of muscle fibers, um, so you can put on a lot of lean body mass as you age with a pillar exercise like squats. Okay, and with this, we'll just kind of go through the form. I'm gonna step underneath, yep. lift up, Yep, you're going to keep your chest big. You want your feet a little bit wider and shoulder width apart. Okay. Um, you're going to squat down where your hamstrings are parallel to the floor, floor and then drive through your heels. You want to inhale on the way down, exhale on the way up. Yep. And he's, see how his torso is staying forward? Like I always talk about, if you have riding on your shirt, you should be able to see that the whole time, even at the downward part of the exercise. So Paul is practicing good form. Sometimes, like with shoes, if you have like shoes that are high in the back, it'll push you forward. So sometimes it's uh, it's indicated to you know maybe be barefoot when you're squatting or have flat shoes. To help okay. With that. All right, and there you go. And we'll have a squat routine on the web on this Fit Friday with Noah Alder.